What's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today is going to be a very quick one. I just want to talk about troubleshooting MAMP. MAMP is a local web server that a lot of developers use on Windows and Mac OS type computers. But in this video, I'm going to talk about what happens if for whatever reason, your MySQL service doesn't start when you start MAMP. So let me just bring this up real quick. So as you can see, I started my local web server. The Apache server started, but the MySQL server hasn't started. So there's a couple of ways you could deal with this. This happens because there could be some conflicts within services on your operating system. You could always go to the task manager and try to find the MySQL servers that's running, but that doesn't always solve the problem. So one very quick way to do this, to resolve this, is open up your file explorer. You want to go to this PC. You want to go to local disk, go to your MAMP folder. You want to go to the DB folder right here. This is where the MySQL part of the software is located. Then you want to go into the MySQL folder and everything that is MySQL-bin and the index file should be deleted. Let me view that extra large. So pretty much this file, the MySQL-bin 0000001, all the way to whatever it goes to over here, just making sure you're only identifying those individual files. Those are the ones you're gonna to wanna to delete along with the mysql-bin.index file. So I'm selecting all those files and now I'm gonna delete them. Now, they are within my recycle bin over here. So what I'll do now is I'll stop the servers you see we're still here. Now I'm going to restart the servers over here. Let's see it's going to recreate those files. So the Apache server is running. And now you see that we have the MySQL server is up and running. And we also have the MySQL-bin and the index file started again. All right, so if you're having difficulty starting your MySQL server with MAMP on Windows, this is a very quick solution to get that resolved. All right, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. If you have any thoughts, ideas, or suggestions, leave them down below, and I will see you in the next video. Happy coding.